Marriage is commended in Scripture to be honorable among all, not to be entered into lightly, but reverently. So thank you, all of you, for being a part of Jordan and Hannah's most special day. It's finally our wedding day, something we have been planning for almost three years now. I can only imagine how beautiful you look right now as you're reading this. I remember how beautiful you looked the first time I met you, how beautiful you looked when I proposed, and I can't wait to see how beautiful you look in the lifetime we are about to spend together. Jordan, I can't believe this day is already here. I feel like it was not long ago that we were messaging back and forth on Facebook and staying up literally all night talking and getting to know each other. We have been looking forward to today for almost three years and it's finally here. From Boone to South Carolina, West Virginia to Concord, there has never been a doubt in my mind that you are the one for me. It was obvious that Hannah and Jordan were made for each other from the very beginning. Jordan spilled an entire stout beer on their first date and Hannah still agreed to go on a second date with her. <laughs> I knew he must have been someone special. Hannah and Jordan are a perfect balance. Patience and unconditional love have brought them this far and will continue to carry them until their very last days. It's a blessing to be loved by you, and I never will take it for granted. And I pray that God gives me the desire and the ability to provide and care for you, that your parents never go to sleep at night wondering if you're being taken care of, that you one day will be the mother to my children, and they inherit your love and compassion, and your very giving heart, and that I'm capable of fulfilling all of your dreams. From this day forward, it's my full desire and my full responsibility to take care of you. Jordan there. Besides him just being a good old Yankee County boy, I mean, I ain't worried about him with my daughter. I'm really proud of him. I couldn't have handpicked a better son-in-law. And uh, you know, no, no matter, <clears throat> no, no, no matter what happens between these two, I'm telling you, Hannah, I'm gonna keep Jordan. <clears throat> I'm, I'm, I'm serious. I'm serious. I mean, if this stuff don't make it, you know, whatever, Jordan's still mine because he said that he wasn't going to put me in a nursing home. <clears throat> As we begin this new journey, I hope we never forget how we felt on the first day we met. I prayed for you before I ever knew you, and I'm so thankful God chose you to be mine. You are selfless, compassionate, hardworking, humble, and kind. It is my greatest privilege to become your wife. 
I choose you to be my husband, my partner, my lover, and my best friend. There is no one else I would rather share my life with. For as much as Jordan and Hannah consented together in holy wedlock and have witnessed the same before God and those, these witnesses, and in so doing have given and pledged their vows to each other, by giving and receiving of a ring by the authority of God and the laws of this state, I now pronounce you man and wife. Matthew 19, 6. Wherefore, they are no longer twain, but one flesh. What God has joined together, let no man put asunder. Jordan, you've been patient. That's right. If this is your cue that you may now kiss your bride. But more importantly, Hannah, you've joined our family. And with everything that I just said about my brother, I extend that to you as well. You've been nothing but a blessing since the first day that you've walked into to Jordan's life. And you've been a blessing to myself as well. And I can promise you right now that both sides of my family thinks nothing better of you than anybody that we've ever met. I extend that on to Wayne and Kim and your family. And I'm just happy to be here with you guys tonight. I'd just like to toast to Jordan and Hannah for the man that he is, the woman that she is and the example that they're going to set for the community going forward. I love you guys, and I wish nothing but the best for you. Thank you. <laughs>